Kogi State Governor Ahmed Ododo has celebrated Kogi born super eagle goalkeeper Ojolon Leke Oluwashegun, who was part of the just concluded African 2023 in the Ivory Coast country. The governor received him and his entourage at the government house, Lokoja. The governor, who could not hide his joy, approved a piece of land and a state award to be served to Olon Leke for making Kogi proud. Ojo Olon Leke was accompanied by the Super Eagle Coordinator Guidance and Team Manager both at the federal and state level. Our reporter has more. Football as a game has over the years tagged as an agent in Nigeria and across the nations. It does not know if you are Igbo, Yoruba or Hausas. Football has the capacity to unite even enemies. That is how powerful it was. And in Kogi State, the governor Ahmed Ododo has promised to leverage on this super game to bring youth and elderly together with an objective to build a better united Kogi State. In their separate remarks, the National Super Eagle Welfare, Guidance and Team Manager, joined with the State Football Association to elogize the performance of Governor Ahmed Ododo within the short period in the office. Presented to him a new jersey that suggests the revolution of sports activities in the state. The visiting Super Eagle team was led by the State Commissioner for Youth and Sports, Monde Ayegbe. You are the people's governor who is so much interested in developing the sports here in our state. We thank you for this short while that you have come on board to lead your people. You have shown keen interest. You have done what we consider as the most interesting part of your developmental stride in sport. We want to thank you. Despite the short notice, you granted us this audience, and we say we appreciate you, we thank you. Say so may God continue to make your reign peaceful. This is not the first time Kogi State will be hosting the Super Eagles. During the tenure of your predecessor, predecessor Alaji um, Yaya Adoza Belo, the White Lion, the Super Eagles legends were hosted in Lokoja, and um, that started what ended up becoming a national movement to use the Super Eagles legends to unite um, the country. So the Super Eagles are synonymous um, with unity. Uh, Your Excellency, as a, as a federation, we have also keyed into the Super Eagles to see how we can also deepen the culture of unity in our state. During the course of the Nations Cup, there was a campaign that was ongoing called the Let's Do It Again campaign. The campaign was aimed at energizing the Super Eagles towards winning the Nations Cup in um, Ivory Coast. Unfortunately, they didn't win. But guess what they did? They made us recommit ourselves to the Nigerian project. To promote unity in our state, we came up with a slogan for the Kogi Football Association. Play football, promote unity. Unfortunately, the first beneficiary is our own government. And I will start for the day. Bless you for what you are doing and your tenure will be one that we will never forget in this Kogi State. Yeah. 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 The star Kogi born super eagle co keeper Ojo Ololu Leke Olu Washegun used the occasion to congratulate the governor on his successful election and subsequently his inauguration. He called for immediate provision of vehicles and a face lift of the state conference stadium to attract more sports activities from across the state and the nations. Your Excellency, sir, I'm here this afternoon to appreciate the Almighty for what he has done for me and also the great privilege to meet you in person. I've been hearing a lot about you. And today I'm seeing you face to face, which I think is something I'm doing forever to celebrate. Mm. Yeah, I want to say I'm a proud son of 
from Bugis State. A lot of people have been saying, ah, it's from here, it's from there. And I was bold enough to tell them that I'm not from Delta State. <laughs> I'm not from Kaduna State. I'm not from uh, Cross River State. I am from Bugis State. <laughs> so, Daddy, I am very happy. And I will also congratulate you too for your victory. And I believe that by the special grace of God, the God that has brought you to this level will never leave you alone. Amen. Yeah. But for a very long time I've been following them up and supporting them too. You know? But one of their major challenges for a very long time now is on the issue of uh, welfare and uh, maybe uh, they are transport how they convey themselves to where they play to the amount which uh, I mean the buses that they've been traveling with. Same thing with the female team too. So what I believe by the grace of God and your present here now, there will be change. I know I believe that. So and again, uh, the stadium, you know, my best performance is so far by playing on that stadium because I know that. But for like five years now, the stadium size has really not been okay for any proper match to be to be played on. So I really want to plead, so that you should help me use your power to do something about it, sir, which I know that yeah, you, I believe you will do it. I'm so confident. Governor Ahmed Ododo assured them of his administration support and assigned the secretary to the state government to arrange for the state award to honor Ojo Ololuleke, among other gifts he has announced. You will be encouraged by the state government and the people of Koki State for you to encourage more younger ones to be successful in their choosing careers so that they can contribute to the development and growth of our dear state. And as such, I am part of you. I struggle like you. You have chosen this career and the state government and the local state will support you to the fullest. <laughs> Shama, I want to appreciate you for standing by him, by the team, and for representing us when indeed yourself, your team members, and everyone has made us proud and you are a true ambassador of our destiny. And as such, in line with Mr. President, you know he has already laid that precedent. The precedent of recognizing those that are doing well. And as such, I have discussed with my council members, we are going to give you, the team manager and the technical manager, a plot of land. This land will be directed to locate a very viable and conducive location for you people so that you can come back home and invest in our land. You see that we have come to realize that what has been affecting us is this issue of unity. And by the special grace of God, we are going to use a football uh, platform to bring our youth together, to bring our elders on one table so that we can discuss the affairs of our dear states. Because we believe in the unity, we believe in the templates of unity that have been laid by the settlers here like the day. We must build on it. If we don't come together to fight the cause for our common people, nobody is coming to do it for us. That is the plain truth. And as such, I want to sincerely appreciate each and every one of us for this singular honor bestowed on me this afternoon to receive you. I don't know where you started your career. I have never met with you, but you have chosen to recognize your state because you are the true son of the soil. And as such, this will not be taken for granted. I sincerely appreciate you. Please, Mr. G. Excellent. We are going to give him the State Service Award. We are going to work it out. <laughs> you know, 
Team Farao, if we don't celebrate our own, nobody's going to celebrate Team Farao. That's true. We must project him. We must show the entire world that we value our own. On their demands, he promised an immediate release of vehicles to aid the state team to and fro wherever they wish to go and play ball. He concluded that the state stadium will in no distance time wear a new look. So we are going to work on it one after the other, especially the issue of office, we are not going to be late. Mobility, I will do that one personally. <laughs> when you have peace and unity, every other thing will be done seamlessly. So, Hassan has already tied this request and the entire body to unity, and that is where I stand. So we are going to get it, and by the special grace of God, in no distance time, people will be coming to Kobe State to book for our stadium. You will recall that the President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, Ahmed Tinebo, on the arrival of the Super Eagles team, honored them with millions of naira a piece of land and a flat each to celebrate them for taking the Super Eagle to a winning level. At the just concluded Falcon 2023 in Abri Coast, I am Faith Abdul Ghaffar reporting for MSC TV.